possible great fights such as Lomachenko, who would probably be the best fighter on Tank's resume, regardless if he has a fight, uh, a loss to Haney. Um, you know, and, and we've seen it, uh, I was trying to say earlier, we've seen it Alex, this weekend. That we've is seen the fighters. problem. What that is, the, is problem? the problem, bro? You're gonna you're gonna wait seven years and Loma still the biggest name on your resume. Motherfucker, kick rocks. Stop defending this god awful dog shit. Motherfucker should have been unified, motherfucker. He should have been fought Loma. You out here capping, man. What the fuck is wrong with you? You a fake. What have I lied about? Listen, I have no issue. It it is a good fight. It's two of the best fights. What are you talking about? Lomachenko is still on some people's pound for pound list. What are you? In one of my earlier videos, the title is Frank Martin is a cherry pick for Javante Davis. Go check it out if you haven't already, please. Um, Thank you for fucking with me. But I got a lot of guys in my comment section talking bad about your boy, man. Talking bad about the big old dog saying that I don't know anything about boxing. I don't know nothing about the sport. And that's all I do is hate. And that it's sad. But the irony in all of this, <laughs> the irony in all of this, man, is the message that I was trying to send to all of my subs, anybody else that came across my channel, boxing fans, um, anybody that I could reach. That same message was co-signed by none other than Shakur Stevenson. can't make this shit up man and that message is and i quote 30 year old prospect hyped off them punching bags he beat if he really was like that i would have been his first option but he'd rather fight cuz who ducked me end quote That's all I was saying. I try to tell y'all, man, but y'all wouldn't listen. This dude, Gervonta Davis, ain't fought nobody. I mean, look at this man's resume and tell me where are the killers on this page, huh? Tell me, where are the killers on Gervonta Davis' resume? What's his best win? Uh, Instant Thought and Ryan Garcia or Hector Luis Garcia. Who the fuck is that guy? You know what I'm saying? A mongoloid and Rolly Romero? I thought it was illegal to beat up on special ed cases. A garden gnome and Eisen Cruz. Uh, Leo Santa Cruz that you had to bring up from 118 pounds. A washed up over the hill Yuri Okis Gamboa. A papa. You had, a, you had a beat up on somebody's papa. I mean, look at this man's resume, y'all. I mean, it's ass. And this dude wants to talk about he's the face of boxing. And so do all of his fanboys. Tank Davis is, in fact, not the face of boxing. Gervonta Davis is the face of ass. And another thing I noticed... I noticed that Abdul Wahid, he only pops this shit on Twitter when all of the top guys in and around his division have fights lined up. Like, oh, what a coincidence. Let's talk shit about Devin Haney when he's got a fight lined up. Oh, another coincidence. He's talking shit about Shakur. Now that Shakur's got a fight lined up. But if y'all noticed, man, a month or so ago, Shakur had nobody to fight. Where was uh, this dude, Abdul Wahid? You know, he was nowhere to be found talking crazy to Shakur. This dude was inside of his house in his dun and pink slippers. 
eating fruity pebbles, watching fucking Real Housewives of Atlanta. But that's all I got for now, fam. I just wanted to react to these Twitter messages that Shakur Stevenson sent to Abdul Wahid co-signing what I was trying to tell you, man, but y'all didn't want to listen to your boy. But hey, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I got to go pay some of these overinflated as bills. Once again, it's been your boy O-Dog Boxing. And I'm out this bitch.